So after you've done all the techniques, after you've listened to all the manifestation videos, some of you guys are telling me that you're confused. One teacher's telling you to do it one way, another teacher's telling you to do it this way. This is what I want you to do. Peace, beautiful people. This is Danny. Welcome back to my channel. On this channel, I talk about all things Law of Assumption. I talk about quantum physics. I sprinkle a little bit of self-care in there. We talk about self-concept. And I just want you to know that on this channel, I dive into how to manifest the life of your dreams by reprogramming your subconscious mind. If you would like to purchase one-on-one -on -one coaching with me or to know about any of my free courses that I offer, check the description box down below. Okay, so today's video is going to be about what to do when you've done everything else and there's really no movement, you're not seeing anything happening, you know, you've tried this 10K affirmations, you've done all the law of assumption techniques that are floating around the community you've even tried law of attraction you've tried everything and you have gotten to the point now where you're just about to give up or you feel like this manifesting thing is just not for you and let me just tell you i've been there before we all want to be master manifestors in the spiritual community but the truth is is that there is an easier way and if you stay tuned to the end of this video i'm going to share with you a really great way for you to get back into alignment with your manifestations and to start seeing your manifestations come into your life. That's what we're here for. Um, we're here to live an abundant life. We're here to enjoy the things that we're calling into our life. Go back to the basics of what the law of assumption says. I want you to go back to Neville's teaching. I have a quote that I want to share with you guys that is going to get you right back into alignment. It's from Neville's book, Freedom for All. It's chapter five. I'm going to share with you guys right now exactly what Neville says about the Sabbath. He says, by keeping the Sabbath a period of mental rest by assuming the attitude of mind that would be yours if you were already visibly expressing this freedom, you will receive the promise of the Lord. What that means is that after you've done everything, there's nothing else to do. It is done. The reason why mental rest is necessary is because now that you have saturated your subconscious mind, you've said all your affirmations, you've done all your visualizations, you've gotten into the state of kin to sleep. Now for your manifestation to show up in your reality, take a mental rest break do nothing go about your day laugh joke you've done enough if you've been doing your techniques over and over and over and you're still not doing a scene movement take a break that's usually when your SP will show up that's usually when the job will call you back saying that you got the position that's usually when now your mind is able to focus on eating healthy so that the weight just melts off of you when you decide to mentally stop stressing and trying to make things happen is when you allow your subconscious mind your infinite intelligence to go to work to bring about the things the circumstances into your reality i have a card that's going to show you how to do an exercise that gets me right back into the present moment so that i can focus on living in the end and focus my thoughts on what would i be thinking what would i be doing what would i be saying as the person who already has their desire. So this is something that I want you to practice and we're gonna do it together. You're gonna to breathe in for four, you're gonna hold for four, you're gonna breathe out for four, and then you're gonna hold for four. And once you hold for four, you're going to breathe out and you're going to tell your mind to relax. Okay, so let's do this together. One, two, breathe in. Breathe out, and I want you to remind yourself to relax. You do this every single time your thoughts are spiraling. You do this every single time that you're watching content and you're watching and looking at the comments and you're complaining in your mind about why isn't my manifestation here. You've done everything, you've done enough. There's nothing else to do. Please find solace in that statement. 